Namaste and greetings. This is Dezango with Sacred Space Yoga, Middle Tennessee. And this is the video accompaniment for the July mid-month 2012 Ohm Times Magazine um, submission. So uh, this month, uh, one of the things that we wanted to talk about was a fitness challenge we've got going locally and we'd be glad to include anyone in it but this is what we're doing uh, on a local level so we started the uh, redneck boot camp and I've already had a couple of people uh, make some suggestions and were afraid that I might offend a few people using the word uh, redneck and I actually I, I thought that was very nice of them to do that I wanted to take a moment to explain what it means to be a redneck I'm gonna take my glasses off for this because I don't need to read this because I know this all right so redneck boot camp is for people who don't have a lot of this as in money it is for people who are generally in rural or uh, low income communities who don't have access to yoga studios and private, you know, uh, health and wellness counseling and dietitian and surgery and you get the point. So these are people that are real. These are people who work. These are people who have a family. These are people who are multitasking and doing uh, many, many things in, in their one 24 hour period. So Redneck Boot Camp is for people that have got all of this stuff going on. Uh, maybe you're just barely getting by. You don't have the money to invest in a program you want to lose weight you want to be healthy you don't have a lot of options uh, another thing about being a redneck is you're probably outside rural communities and um, especially parts of Tennessee this is an agriculture based state uh, we send our flora all over the world. We've got nurseries that are amongst the best in the world. So a lot of people work outside. We get a red neck because we're out in nature. So being a redneck is not a bad thing. Uh, I am not ashamed of being a redneck. It's, you know, it's who we are. And the boot camp part is a jump start. It's, uh, you know, get serious, take control. So let's begin with that. I've explained the name. It's, uh, and again, of course, everyone is welcome. But when I started doing this, I had to look at ways to help people, myself, on how to get healthy when there weren't many resources. There's not many people to connect with. There's not uh, a huge health and wellness community in this area. So we have to do what we have to do. And uh, what I've discovered is that Mother Nature and uh, the daily routine is plenty to get everything done you need to do. So let's let's take a look at that. Back to reading. So uh, when you are ready to make some changes in your life, one thing that uh, we recommend that you do is you take a dare you that's easy you've heard everybody's daring you to this but it, it's the same principle D you have to have desire 
you actually have to want to change your life. I can't do it for you, your mom can't do it for you, your husband or wife can't do it for you, you, you're the only one that can do it. So you have to have that desire. A, you need to assess the situation, your current situation, your health, your body, your, um, you know, predicament. Exactly, where are you? And you need to accept responsibility. R. You need to remove all blame. Don't blame others. Don't blame yourself. This is the beginning of a new day. So there's no blame. And the last one, E. You need to explore natural options. Look at ways to get healthy that don't require a lot of money, that don't require uh, an investment of time to drive there when you don't have the time. You've got a family, you've got a second job, you've, you know, just got a life. And being healthy should be a big part of that, but sometimes it's hard to fit it in. It just, it is. So, those are the things that we recommend that you just get started, take a look at. And if you want to get in with the, um, with the, with the Redneck Boot Camp, uh, right now we're hanging out at myfitnesspal.com forward slash Dezengo, D-E-Z-E-N-G-O. Uh, I have a blog there. So we are, we're keeping this at home times and we're using the functionality of mobile world to uh, be able to scan our foods in, to monitor our daily exercise. That place has got it going on. So uh, one of my favorite uh, places as far as like keeping up with my, my daily intake of food. Sometimes I forget to put it in, but generally it's so easy. They make it easy to count your calories, uh, anything you want to, put your measurements in. Love that place. So myfitnesspal.com forward slash Dezango. You can uh, keep up with us there. We, uh, we also have a contest going on. So uh, this month, Whoever wins, uh, loses. We haven't really set the goal yet. I'm letting everyone else set the goal. So, right now, I still got this sitting, waiting to go to you. Alright, so, this is your 30 days of fitness. Redneck Boot Camp, dare to change your life, dare to step up and manifest the life you've been wanting. You can do it. You've got it all within. So, are you ready? I think you are. I know I am. So, alright, let's do it. I'm not going to yell at you and... Uh, we're not gonna we're not gonna email you and bug you and harass you. It's up to you. But we want to be there to share it with you and we'll give you ideas and we'll give you tips on things that you can do that are around your house, that are, you know, maybe even within the local community, places to volunteer that, you know, build muscles and burn calories. So, you know, let's do it. Let's let's make the change. Om Shanti. Oh, until the next time. Dezengo, sign off. <laughs>